Here we have two separate pieces of 3D printed resin that we'd like to join together to make one seamless piece. Now one of the first things we will need is some Serana Acrylite Super Glue. We'll go ahead and carefully apply a generous bead of glue to one surface. An optional but very useful step would be to apply an accelerator to the second opposite piece we wish to join. This will greatly speed up the setting of the super glue. Be sure to use care to properly align both halves as you will only have a quick moment to get the placement right before the super glue and accelerator go to work. While there are many options for how to fill the seam, in this video we will examine using the same UV curable resin that we used to make our parts. For this next step, we will need a UV flashlight, a paintbrush, and a small amount of our UV curable resin. Using our brush, we can apply some of the UV resin directly onto the seam and allow it to begin to seep in and fill the narrow void. It is okay to have some excess as we'll be sanding this all smooth. In a way, you could look at it as if you're creating a sort of a weld between the two pieces. After applying a small amount along the seam, we can use the UV flashlight to directly cure our resin weld. Several seconds is all that is needed to cure what we've applied. Go ahead and repeat this process until the entire seam is filled. You can apply more resin directly over areas where a void or divot needs to be filled. Once we are satisfied that the entire seam has been filled, we can move on to sanding down the excess resin to get our invisible seam line. Some 100 grit sandpaper was more than sufficient to sand things to a nice smooth finish. After just a few quick minutes and very little effort, you can already see the satisfying results. Let's continue on to the front. Here you can see the results after an application of gray sprayable filler primer. You can even continue sanding with finer grits until you achieve the smooth, invisible seam we are going after. Remember that this is just one of many ways to join your 3D printed resin pieces together and fill the seams to make them look like one finished piece. I hope that you found this information useful. Keep on making and keep on creating.